So Donald Trump's criminal trial has begun. They gave the opening argument. David Pecker is on the stand. They're going to wrap things up at 1230 today because apparently an alternate juror has a fucking dentist appointment. I don't know what's up with that. But anyway, that's how the first day is going to go. We'll talk more about it after it's all done when we know what exactly happened. But I want to talk about something else. I want to talk about the hearing that went on today to determine the legitimacy of Donald Trump's $175 million bond. Now, from all appearances, what we've seen, it's not legitimate. It's not real. So presumably, they would say, no, we're not accepting this. Well, something happened today, and Letitia James negotiated with Donald Trump's lawyer for another deal to maintain the bond. Apparently, there is some Schwab account with cash in it that somehow uh, the, the, the insurance company that posted the bond will now have control of. See, this... This Schwab account does have enough money to cover the bond, but Donald Trump has access to it so he can buy things, sell things, lose things, and whatever. So the deal they cut was this Schwab account will be the bond, but Donald Trump cannot have control over it. The insurance company has to have control over it. Still sounds kind of shady to me, but apparently Letitia James is happy with it, and I guess that's all that matters. So at this point... The bond stands for $175 million in his appeal for that particular court case. It's weird. It's not what I expected, but, you know, that's that's what happens in these cases. You can always expect the fucking unexpected.